Well, your weekend plans might include working outside. If your yard gets a lot of shade, there are lots of options for what to plant. Yeah, KZI 9 News anchor Sean Cuero shows us some beautiful plans for your yard for every season in this week's In the Garden. A KZI 9 News viewer wanted to know more about shade plants. We gave Caleb Johnson with Johnson Brothers Greenhouses this tough assignment, and boy, did you deliver. Yeah, a lot of people think they're limited if they've got a shady garden or shady yard, and I simply wanted to show, no, you have lots of options, uh -huh. and I've kind of organized it by what looks good in each season, starting with winter. How many plants do we have here? So winter, I've just got a few options. There's hellebores, which always look great, heuchera, Pansies and violas, which are in bloom in the winter season. And moving on to spring. spring. Yeah, we've got Sinetti's, Jacob's Ladder, which have the interesting foliage and color. And then Bleeding Hearts, which are another this. popular yes. one, along with Azaleas, of course. Those are another fantastic one for that spring season. And come summer. Summer, Astilbes, which have the nice big uh, panicles of red, white, pink. Hostas, which are just all leafed out and looking great. Japanese forest grass, just a nice bright grass for a, a dark spot. And mm -hmm. a different texture too. Mm -hmm. Yep, and then hardy fuchsias, which just get loaded full of blooms. New Guinea impatience, begonias, <laughs> so many fun choices for yeah. the summer. And then comes fall. Yeah, so Wind fall, down. yeah, so fall you've got Cape daisies, ferns look great in the fall again, heuchera looks good all year, but in the fall especially. And then hey, just for the heck of it, you got kale, you can plant white, Red, kale, lots of fun colors, and then again, pansies and violas. A lot of color for your garden, for your shade area. And to see a list of all those plants we just mentioned, you can go to kezi.com and click on the features tab. And if you have a gardening question that you would like Caleb to answer, just go to our website and fill out the contact form.